This video is going to be all about even and odd numbers. So here's a selection going on for the circus. They need some more animals. So here are some animals ready for the selection. But there's a rule. The circus wants pairs of animals from the same group. So we're going to group animals into pairs of two. Let's start grouping now. But uh-oh, when we look at one, the elephant can't be grouped because it doesn't have a pair. But when we look at two, the raccoons can be grouped because there are two of them. And for three, there's one bunny left out. And for four, there, there are no tigers left out. And for five, there's one giraffe left out. For six, there are no lions left out. For seven, there are, there's one teddy bear left out. For eight, there are no pigs left out. For nine, there's one duckling left out. Now we're going to send the pairs of animals to the circus. As you can see, one, three, five, seven, and nine are all odd numbers because there's one animal left out. And two, four, six, eight are all even numbers because there are no animals left out. So even numbers can be split by two evenly and the remainder will be zero. But odd numbers on the other side cannot be evenly grouped by two and the remainder will be one. So let's see where all, all the numbers from zero to nine all go in the sections. One goes in the odd section because the remainder is one. Two goes in the even section because two can even can be evenly grouped by two and the remainder will be zero. Three goes in the odd section, four goes in the even section, five goes in the odd section, six goes in the even, seven goes in the odd, eight goes in the even, nine goes in the odd, and now where does zero go? It goes in the even section because zero is divisible by two and there's no remainder. Let's look at some examples now. Here's how you can recognize an even number. At the ones place, if it's a zero, two, four, six, or eight, it's an even number. And an odd, and, and an odd number is if the ones place has a one, three, five, seven, or nine. So let's look at 42. Where does it go? Look at, the, look at the last number. It's 2, so it goes in the even section. Now let's look at 29. You might be confused because 2 is an even number and 9 is not. But we're looking at the ones place, so 9 is an odd number, so it goes in the odd section. Now let's look at 154. The last number is 4, so it goes in the even section. Now let's look at another example as 873. The last number is 3, so it goes in the odd section. Now let's look at 1566. The last number is 6, so it goes in the even section. Now let's look at 763028455. Confused? The la it's easy. Just look at the last number. It's 5, right? 
So it goes in the odd section. 